Hey y'all, it's Polka and I'm back with another episode. Coming in at number five is, drumroll please, Vicky Love. Before we hop into it, let's get into it. Let me show you who I'm rocking. So today I have on a black owned clothing brand called Simply K and 20% of all of her sales go to Lupus Research. So these are her leather, sexy leather, okay. White pants. So y'all go support my girl. It's where fashion and women health come together. So don't miss out. You gotta find your birthday. This is so dope, you did it? Thank you, yes. <laughs> Wait. I'm scared. What is this? It's a motivational book, so every day it's a motivational quote. Okay, let me read it. <laughs> you have the power to be at peace when everything is hell. Choose happiness over sadness and share with the world. <laughs> Girl! <laughs> Jay told me you would like it. <laughs> so as some of you may know, the ones that have been following me and reaching out for my help and assisting with life coaching, public speaking, motivational services, and all of those wonderful things, I also offer personal business management services. And basically what that is, is like a life coach for your business. Well, one of my close friends and also one of my clients uh, specializes in events and particularly college events. So during our homecoming, I was brought onto the team to be the personal uh, business manager for his company, also known as his executive assistant. He put me in close contact with Miss Vicky Lowe. I helped her get into our hotel room. I booked the hotel room. I made sure she had what she needed to perform. And we started building a relationship from there. My focus point during this time was just to make sure his events went perfect nobody was hurt um, everything was just put in place but he supported me outside of just being his assistant and he put me in contact with her on purpose she actually wound up coming to the location that we were staying in at the time and picking up some items she needed to perform and while doing so he was like give her give her the book so i gave her the book she loved it she uh asked me was i a psychic <laughs> because what she was reading actually was part of a conversation she was having uh with somebody that she was with so it was good vibes she was like really lit like i can honestly say that. like vicky Lowe, she was lit about the book telling me how dope it was to keep going um and was just really supportive in that aspect. Every time you give out something, or especially when I give out something to a celebrity, you never know how they're going to take it because a lot of times people always want something from them. So just giving them something and then them connecting with it means a whole lot more, especially when you listen to their music, you know who they are. And yeah, it was a wonderful experience. So that's how I got my book to Miss Vicky Lowe. Thank you for supporting me. Thank you for sharing me out on Instagram. And thank you for all your good energy. And I'll see y'all at the next episode. You ready? <laughs> <laughs> I want you to read it. We was just... What did it say? Wow. That's, that's creepy. <laughs> that's, crazy, bro. that's creepy, weird, but that's like... That's real. It was February 8th. Her said, um, stay open minded. Your heart can be someone safely. But she was not to just like, but she was just talking about that. Mm -hmm. Like, that's her space right now. Like, this is. Well, thank you. This is dope. Like, for like real. Like Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> that's going on my bookshelf, girl. That's real. Thank you. Thank I'm gonna you. I'm going to have to start getting people to get, get your birthday. I got to see what your energy is. Your aura. <laughs> Where you, where you at? Man. Okay. <laughs> it's too much.